Tell me about this scene in the restaurant where Garbo falls into laughter. This obviously is the key to the whole movie uh, and that uh, it must have been the inspiration behind uh, both the script and uh, uh, Lubitsch's direction that, uh, uh, that this was going to be the, the fulcrum of the, uh, of the two parts of the film uh, going from the, uh, the stony-faced commissar uh, which Garbo plays um, in very much a traditional vein, um, suddenly, and it's a beautifully constructed scene, um, melting into this uh, woman who uh, uh, begins to see what uh, uh, the, the, uh, the, the man who's pursuing her is able to offer her. Uh, and uh, he, uh, uh, Melvin Douglas, I think, uh, uh, plays it with, uh, with, with, with real skill, uh, but it's, it's a two-way trade-off. Um, and uh, when you cut to her laughing her head off, uh, it has a real uh, surprise uh, but also a sense of gratification. I don't know whether that was as, uh, as, as true at the time that it, it was released because this was the selling point but uh, and so everybody knew that they were at some point going to see Garbo laughing um, uh, but when it comes uh, it, it's a very warm and satisfying moment.